All right, you guys seen that picture in the beginning of the video. This story takes place in Sheffield, England, across the pond. Basically, a woman fights back against a would-be sex attacker. The, pic the man in the picture, his name is Jonathan Holmes. He tried to jump this woman on the streets late at night. But he ended up getting two black eyes and numerous gashes to the face. Well, apparently on Tuesday, the Sheffield man pleaded guilty to the November 1st attack and was sentenced to four and a half years in prison. The woman testified in court that he followed her in the early morning hours for over a mile before pouncing on her and knocking her into some bushes. Fortunately, she, fortunately for her, she realized she was being followed and prepared herself by placing her car keys in her hand as a potential weapon, she testified. She also pulled out her, her phone to call her partner. As Holmes forced herself on her back and climbed on top of her, he told her, quote, you are going to enjoy this, end quote. He then thrust his tongue into her mouth and she chomped down on it as hard as she could when he relaxed his grip she maneuvered herself on top of him and with her car keys pressed it to his neck continued screaming for help she told the court <clears throat> two passerbys heard her cries and likely prompted and likely prompted his attempt to flee but as he did he tried to jump over some railings and he only injured himself some more. The quote of the lady said, he won't do anything like this to a woman again. Harrison told the star, quoting the would-be victim. Well, let me just say this, ma'am. You're a badass. And I say that on the, on the principle that you wasn't going down like that. She already knew that this, this nutcase was falling her. So she was just like, you know what, I'm not going to scream, I'm not going to run, I got my car keys, I got my phone, and I got my bare hands, and we about to rumble. So, he promises on her, but she happens to get, get able, she's able to flip him over and just starts going in on the guy. And I don't blame her, because that fight or flight that every human has, it kicks in sometimes. Are you going to run, or are you going to fight? This woman still her ground. Now... Him being sentenced to four and a half years, that, in a way, that might be long for some. Me, I wish it might have been a little bit longer because who knows? He may have tried to do this to some other people on the streets of Sheffield, England. And we don't know what this woman was doing. She could have been coming home from work, could have been coming home from the pub or the bar with her friends. Just You just don't know. It's just, at nighttime, you definitely got to be careful. But... She fought back. You know, she said she was not going to be no victim, even though he was thrusting his tongue down her throat and all this. No, no. He, he deserved that ass kicking. And I'm glad she hand delivered it to him. So, when he does get out, he probably won't attempt to do that again to somebody else. But in cases like this, they're pro he's probably going to do it again. But he picked the wrong female to try. To sexually assault because she beat that ass. You guys, comment down below and let me know what you think about this story. See you later, everybody.